This is David Justin. We're in Hollywood, the Lexington Social House, and you're watching Teen Infonet. How are you doing? I'm doing good. How are you? I'm great. So we're here at the Lexington Social House. How are you excited are you for tonight? I'm very excited about tonight. I'll be here with my band and just really just showcasing all my new material mm -hmm. and just hoping to put off a lot of new a lot of high energy and uh, just hoping to get that back from the fans as well. Can you tell us about your set list tonight? Um, I'll be doing all new songs that I've written. Um, I've only played them once live before. It was an acoustic set. So again, this is with a live band. There's going to be a lot of high energy and uh, just accept, just expect to have a lot of uh, a lot of fun in, in, at the show tonight. So how do you usually prepare yourself for a show? I usually just try to wind down mentally. I usually kind of just go in the back and just uh, try to clear my head for about 10 minutes and then just go and give high fives to my band members and uh, just get pumped up. And do you have any very embarrassing stage moments? I don't think I really have any embarrassing stage moments yet, but if I did, I wouldn't tell you. <laughs> so you have a new song called Supernova yeah, and yeah. the music videos came out today on Vivo. Yeah, so excited. Yeah, very how, excited about that. How or what were you thinking about when you were writing it? What inspired you? Um, you know, I was out here, this is about a year ago, I was doing a lot of recording sessions with some different producers, and the word Supernova kept kind of mm -hmm. coming to my head, and um, I was kind of unsure, I knew I wanted to write a song that had the word Supernova in it, but I didn't really know how to interpret it into a song, and, uh, and at the time I just really kind of read more into what a Supernova really was, and when I looked up the definition, it's actually a cluster of stars mm -hmm. that collide and they die off and it emits this bright light, which is a supernova. And I thought, well, that's pretty much kind of how I feel right now. Uh, I feel like I've given up so many things just to reach this point where I can, you know, of this dream of being a successful recording artist. So that's, that's kind of how I took that into perspective. And uh, we actually wrote that song in about four hours and recorded it four hours later. later. So it was a really fun session um, and just very excited about how it came out. And actually right now, it's actually playing in Europe on the second largest station on Skyrock FM. So it's gaining mo momentum over there and just really excited about how, how it's come out. And what was it like working with Caitlin O'Connor on the video? Caitlin O'Connor, she's the 2013 hottest Maxim model. So it was great to have her a part of the project. She's very professional and very sweet person. So it just, yeah, it was just a fun video to shoot. And is it harder trying to write music or trying to make a video that matches your music? Writing songs isn't always easy. Sometimes we'll have a writing session where, you know, something will just kind of come to you or it's something that I've been kind of rehearsing and writing. As far as shooting a music video, that's pretty much easy because they just basically give you a script, they tell you what to do, and uh, you just sit back and have fun, and, and they do all the all the behind the scenes hard work. So yeah, definitely music mu music videos are, are simple and fun. And is there anyone that you'd like to tour with? There's, there's a lot of artists that I would like to tour with. I wouldn't say I have one in particular, but maybe just somebody who has the same vibe, uh, same style as me and same charisma. Uh, that way we could just, uh, you know, cross-reference different fans and just let fans hear new material. And who's on your playlist right now? Who's on my playlist? <laughs> I listen to so many different styles. Um, I like, I just like any artist that's talented. I mean, I, I grew up, I played classical music, uh, played the violin, played the drums, played guitar, um, played a little bit of keys. So, uh, yeah, I, I, I mean, I, anything from pop, rock, to uh, um, electronic, to, um, uh, Americana, folk rock, it, it pretty much is just, it's pretty much just a big set of uh, uh, songs and, and artists out there that I listen to. And do you have a favorite instrument? Uh, I would say, I would, <laughs> I would say by far guitar, it's, uh, that's my number one go-to instrument that I, that I like to write songs. So you write your own songs, and have you ever written a song and go back to like, oh, what was I thinking when I was writing it? Uh, <laughs> Sometimes, uh, usually I don't really follow through with those songs and I'll kind of just uh, put those on the back burner. But sometimes I'll be able to take away different parts of what I wrote and, and use it for other songs. So what's, what's next for you right now? Uh, just looking at touring, trying to get some labels and some publishers um, um, locked in and, uh, and really just, just be able to go out and, and spread my, my music to the fans and to the world. And do you have a message for your fans? Yeah, I just really like to tell them that I'm very thankful uh, for all their encouraging words and just supporting me because without them, I wouldn't be doing what I love to do, and that's 
you know, being here tonight, playing at the Lexington Social House. And Lassie, where can people find your music? The best way to find my music would probably be to go to my website, davidjustin.com. Um, and like we said before, they can go to David Justin Vivo and watch and listen to my new single, uh, Supernova. All right, well, thank you very much. We're here. David Justin yeah. having this nice show tonight. Be sure to check out Supernova on Vivo. We're here at the Lexington Social House. We're going to rock it tonight. <laughs>